Hello Sagittarius and welcome to your reading for August 2021. So this is going to be about your twin flame journey or personal journey. Anything the angels want you to know about this powerful month ahead. So thank you for being here and if you are new to the channel, welcome, subscribe, join our family because we're here for you every day. So we're going to use four powerful decks of cards for this reading. The Work Your Light Oracle deck, the Divine Love Messages Through Music and the Messages Through Music Oracle deck and the Radiant Rider Waite Tarot. I feel there may be some muddled energy around you this time. So, you know, if you feel things are a bit muddled this month, if you feel things need to be put in order, put them in order. And Archangel Metatron will help you to get things done. So thank you, angels. What's the energy, please, around Sagittarius for this month? Okay, for August then, we've got coming out for you, save your tears. Wow, save your tears. So in other words, the angel's saying there's no need to cry about this connection because everything is happening well. Everything is working out. You know, if you feel that you're a bit emotional this month or, you know, you're crying over things, the angels are saying save your tears. Everything is working out beautifully, perfectly. Magic is coming in. And I knew I loved you. So this person is kind of saying to you, I knew I loved you. I knew I loved you then and I know I love you now. And you knew that you loved them too. So this is about understanding that you both care. You both love each other in your twin flame journey or in your relationship. So there's no need to cry. So the angels are coming through saying, save your tears. Obviously cry if you need to release things and to get emotion out. But you don't need to. Because they know they loved you then and they they knew that then and they know they love you now. So if you're crying because you're thinking, do they even care about me? Okay, they don't care. Is it going to happen? They're happy where they are. The angel saying, save your tears because the best is yet to come. So what do we need to know, please, for Sagittarius? We've got here the great gathering. It's all coming together. And this is really the energy I'm feeling for you. It's all coming together, so save your tears. There's no need to cry. There's no need to be upset. There's no need to worry. Everything is as it's meant to be. There's about to be a great gathering. So this is about communication. Maybe there's going to be an event in your life this month where there will be a great gathering. And we haven't been able to have those for a long time because of restrictions. So you may be invited to a social occasion. You know, you may be invited to a wedding or you know, a party or some form of event where there is a great gathering. Maybe there's a great gathering online that you're going to. So if you've been invited to things this month, go for it because it's all coming together. We've got intuitive hits. So trust your intuition. You're going to receive hits from your angels, you know, intuitive hits. Things may hit you up. You may get hit up on social media, you know, people asking you to do things social invitations i feel that's a big one for you this month that you're going to get asked to do things you may not want to do things but you're going to be invited to things and you know it's all coming together it's the way the universe is showing you they're all as well so for example if you want marriage and you got invited to a wedding it's a sign of what's to come you know if you get invited to a party or you hear about reunion it's showing you what's to come it's all coming together and soul tribe so you have your family here on this channel you're connecting now with like-minded people you're connecting with your soul tribe and that's giving you power and it's helping you to save your tears so you don't cry anymore about this connection or worry about it because you realize all this well and that other people have been through what you were going through too you've got the eight of swords so release yourself from negativity Release yourself from karmic binds or anything that's holding you back. So I'm seeing this in two ways for you. I'm seeing this as maybe your person is involved in an energy they can't yet release. You know, they may be tied up or tangled up in something, which means a karmic situation. You know, they aren't seeing things clearly yet. They may not be awake just yet. They may not quite be ready yet in August to move forward. But it's all coming together. So save your tears. Hey, don't cry. Don't worry about it because it's all going to be okay. This is a call for you to love you and love your life and go where you're guided to go and do what you're guided to do and enjoy yourself while they deal with their own fear. This could also be you kind of trapped in your own fear about what's going on and what's happening. 
And the angel saying, save your tears, it's okay. They knew they loved you then and they know they love you now. It will move forward, it will be okay. This could be you wanting to go to an event, but there's restrictions and you can't. So we're all in different stages of releasing lockdowns and, you know, things happening all over the world. So, you know, take the part of this message that resonates with you. But I feel this trap feeling, it's either what's happening with restrictions in your physical world that you may feel is restricting your life and that's creating tears. And the angel saying, save your tears because you're being protected right now. Or it's the fact that you feel in emotional binds and you're not sure what to do. So raise your vibration and focus on love because you can release yourself from these binds anytime you like by having faith. What else do we need to know about your journey right now? What do we need to know? Pulling out the deck here. So we've got expect powerful change. So there's great changes coming in. So if you're worrying about your karmic situation or your person being in what, or about your life being held back by restrictions, expect powerful change. You know it's real and true. They know it's real and true. And this time there is no turning back. And that's why we've got the message that shows to you and you are loved you. Because they know it's real, you know it's real, and it's about to change. Take the pressure off. You can't force control or put conditions on unconditional love. So save your tears. Remember, you may be worrying about things being held back or things being stuck or trapped energy. But everything is happening for your higher good. You're being protected. When it's the right time, it will happen. When you are both ready... The universe will move things into place. So you might not be quite ready, but expect powerful change. What hurts you heals you and makes you stronger. So save your tears. The journey can cut like a knife and you will feel it deep within your soul. But the pain will grow you and make you stronger. God would never give you anything you can't handle. Remember your power. You are a warrior of love and that you are safe. So when it's hurting you, when it's cutting deep into you and you feel emotional and you're crying, the angels are saying, save your tears because the best is yet to come and there will be a happy ever after. Your union is truly meant to be. What a beautiful message. So the angels are saying to you, expect things to change. You will have your happy ever after. So save your tears. It's all coming together. It may feel restricted right now, like there's a big wall in the way. You know, things aren't happening, but they are about to change. Magic is coming in and you will receive everything you want. So if you've seen the stag, that's the sign of union. You're being reminded of that power. If you see bees, it's a sign of miracles coming in. So trust in this. You are safe, loved and protected and everything is as it's meant to be. Have a great month sending you so much love and I'll see you soon.